Welcome back to the Roadshow this morning in the buzz. With back to school, many parents have been out shopping for new clothes for their kids, but there is one t-shirt on the market they're not going to be able to buy uh -huh. because uh, JCPenney pulled a very controversial shirt from its website that consumers had declared sexist. Here it is. Ooh. Take a look. The girl's shirt reads, I'm too pretty to do homework, so my brother has to do it for me. The shirt was being marketed to girls between the ages of 7 and 16. It was 10 bucks. A caption next to photos of the shirt online read, Who has time for homework when there's a new Justin Bieber album out? She'll love this tee that's just as cute and sassy as she is. Soon after the shirt went online, outraged customers made an online petition to stop selling clothes with sexist messages for girls. J.C. Penney pulled the shirt and released a statement saying, quote, we agree. It does not deliver an appropriate message. We immediately discontinued its sale. Does the shirt offend you? I don't think it offends me, but it's stupid. I mean, it's like, why would, you know, why not send a worse, you know, I'm so pretty that I can go, you know, do drugs, or right. I, you know, I mean, that's probably a little bit extreme. But <laughs> that it's would like, be a top is it, seller. Is it sending a poor message? Yes. yes. Is it so offensive that it needs to be yanked off the shelf? No. No. This is a fun T-shirt. If someone yeah. wants to wear it, they're not saying, "Hey, I'm pretty and dumb, so mm -hmm. someone else does my work for I me." I think it's dumb no, that I they pulled it. That I really age, do. I think it's like if I saw a kid wearing that, I would think, "Ha ha!" Like I wouldn't think, <gasps> "Shocking." You know? Okay. Right. Would you let your daughter wear it to school? No, but I wouldn't. I would you buy one for your daughter? No. Okay. I wouldn't, but it doesn't mean I don't think other people could. I wouldn't wear one because I don't Other have people a can pull it off besides your daughter? I don't know, but I, I don't <clears> think it's a huge deal. I think there's so many other t shirts that are so much more inappropriate that you see kids wearing. Or not even just the, the message that the fabric sends or the cut sends is worse than that little cartoon. You know what I mean? It well, was a cartoon, I, kind of. I don't, I'm not gonna. I don't mean to pepper you with this, yeah. but if it's if if it's such if it's such so bad that your daughter can't wear it, why is it okay for others to wear it? Because it's a choice. I don't know. I don't think there should be a blanket ban on the shirt. But you it's think not, it's bad? I don't think it's bad. I just don't think it's great. It's like it's just okay. You know? I mean, I, I, I'm just. That I'm behavior. Behavior. Would you let Casey wear one? No. Why not? Because it sends a bad message. Oh, okay. But I, I said it should be pulled. I, th I think it's stupid. But you say it shouldn't be pulled, but it's, it's good enough for other people to wear, but not your daughter. That's why I don't get it. I'm just not offended by it's it. It's a personal just, choice. I'm not offended. Like I said, if I saw another kid wearing it, I wouldn't be offended by it. Would mm -hmm. I pick it out? No. But that goes with, with any other type of clothing. Just like you when know, I put my daughter in a miniskirt. No. Right. Other kids wear them. Whatever. There shouldn't be a blanket ban on everything just because I don't like it. But I, but I see how the message is. Mini skirts are universally accepted clothes. T shirts are universally accepted clothes? Not with stupid messages on them. Yeah, are you kidding me? Go to any store. There's like stupid messages on like every t shirt you see on the market, everything. Even SpongeBob is yeah. stupid. Well. <laughs> Right? Am I right? Attention with a knife. Who do you want the camera to talk back to you? <laughs> no. Please, piece of equipment. <laughs> would you agree with me? No, no, but I, but I understand how enough enough people or enough parents would, would take offense to this, basically saying, you know, oh, what? You you can't be pretty and smart. You just have to be, you know. It's really the, the way lame. that you're getting by in life it's is just lame. by your looks. It's so, lame that they pulled it. Oh, come on. I I agree with that. I I agree that the fact that they you know they pulled it might be a little too extreme. I wonder how many they sold before they pulled it. That would be the question. Obviously, it probably wasn't a top seller, because if it was, they probably wouldn't have yanked it. What's my problem I today? I so. <laughs> Patrick? Wow. Back to you. <laughs> I told you how I feel about it. I think it's stupid. It should be pulled. It should mm -hmm. be pulled. Yes. Michaela and I say no, it shouldn't be. But it's, I, I, I okay, yeah, pulling but it was I'm a little not too extreme. Would I buy it? Would I wear it? No. I can't believe you're continuing to argue with me about that. Are you just trying to like stir the pot? Or do you really think that my argument is weak? I think your argument's weak and I'm trying to stir the pot. Some of both. I'm done with you. I'm going to head over to Courtney <laughs> because I'm done with him today. I'm afraid. It's like getting loud and then really quiet. I'm not sure like... I want to jump in there. I will say, I, I think if people complain about t-shirts all the time and, and pulling a lot of them is going to be a lot of work for the companies because as Danielle said, these things are choices made by parents. But it seems a lot of people are offended by it, so they seem to not mind that it's gone from JCPenney's online store. So let's start on the live blog on foxprovidence.com. And Hawk said, as an adult, of course, I wouldn't take anything on a t-shirt too seriously. However, society is making it more and more difficult for young girls you know, to be confident in who and what they are. E-Rock said, if I had a sister growing up, she would have worn a shirt like that. Maybe not the most appropriate thing in the world, but people need to not be so oversensitive.
So the poll we're asking today, are you offended by the t-shirt? A, yes, it's promoting looks over brains. B, no, it was meant to be just a joke. This buzz has generated a lot of comments already on the Roadshow Facebook page. Both split down the middle. Marie said it definitely is not teaching the right idea to young children. Anyway, what mother would buy that for her daughter? I would think it just wouldn't sell. Elizabeth said it sends a negative message to girls. She said, I agree with Marie. I would have never purchased that shirt for any of my three daughters. Kat Lang, however, said, I think it's funny. It's made to be funny, not serious. I don't see why people are taking it seriously. And Sabrina said, you know, is that she would buy it because it's just a shirt. She said kids wear way worse than that. So I could see everybody's side there, but it has to be one answer in the poll. So we will see what you all say as Roadshow viewers at the end of the show. We're